Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're back to Star Renegades tonight. Last time we left off, uh, headed into the big boss battle for the second area here. So, we're about to start with a big boss battle here, I think. Um, we'll just do a quick double check on our, on our party and our loadout, and it'll be, uh... We'll be into the fight, I think. Okay, so everybody's pretty much at full health. Uh, we're down a bit of armor on our front runner, which is a bit troublesome. Um, but everybody else is looking pretty okay. Not, not bad stuff. Not bad stuff going on here. Um, we're level fives across the board, except for our pro tag. She's at level six. Feels good. Feels like we're in a good spot. So let's uh, let's camp and head into the battle, I guess. Um, let's see, I wouldn't mind, like, a, a quick heal on folks if we can do that. Um, I don't know who's got that, though. Health defense seems pretty good. Uh, draining shields also seems good. Okay, there's a heal. And then extra shield defense. Um, that seems pretty good for our, our front runner. so let's, let's go ahead and do that. Extra shield defense etc etc and then we can uh be like i don't know let's get some shield stealing too i think one of our uh here health defense seems good too i don't know if we should put that on uh our healer though or we should use that on who should we use that on health defense like maybe our spiritual robot dude he tends to take a, a few hits but uh honestly wouldn't mind putting that on our front runner either so let's do that not enough to to get him to level one friendship there but that's fine um I'm sure whatever we the game there wouldn't have made much difference okay here we go we're ready Ready to do the fight. Ready to see what we're about to get our asses kicked by. Uh, okay. Darosh Behemoth. Rude and Ruthless is the first one. Well, the first one was kind of a pushover, honestly. The first Behemoth we fought was... Nothing. <laughs> nothing, I think. But that was also just the first area, so... You know. Okay, I guess we're ready to go. Let's do it. Do it. Hey, game over. How you doing? See ya. Okay, so this is a four-on-one, a four-on-one four fight here. Oh, but he's got a, an opening debuff. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that does. Um. Uh. Here. Oh, it's, it slows us down by five seconds for six for six turns. My God. Okay. Well, you know what? That's probably fine. We've got kind of the speed buff from our uh, healer <laughs> kind of offsetting it really um, but let's see what we're dealing with here oh god it's a group attack I hate it um, alright let's uh, mayhaps not let that happen uh, what do we have there oh can attack twice per round oh great really that seems bad um, if stunned goes rabid and retaliates with deadly force okay so don't stun it huh Oh, that's a big problem, because uh, we've got a lot of stun attacks. <laughs> uh, and it's got some defense versus staggering, too. Uh, I hate it. Okay, well... Boy, our healer's going to take a big-ass hit there. Um, Alright, everybody's going to take a hit. Um, but we need like some big hits to, to push him to the next round here. Like this one. Yeah. He's got a lot of fucking shields. How much shield does this guy have? 700 shield and 1300 health. Ah. And 60 armor on top of all that. So, uh. I don't know. I don't know if this fight's gonna go great. Uh. uh Alright. Um. Well, could reduce its defense. Uh, well, actually, since we don't really need 
don't really need the speed up, I don't think. So let's do, uh... Yeah, what, what would we need to do? Okay, there's... Cleave is right there. We could do Cleave later. Pierce's armor does a whole bunch against shield, right? Well, whole bunch is a loaded term. Um... Why don't we blitz this motherfucker in the next turn? Or... Uh, do I have anything... Hmm... Do I have anything that can debuff this asshole? No, I really don't. Okay, I could give my heavy hitters some extra beef there. What does that do? 50% increased damage. Uh... <laughs> huh? Um... Or I could do explosives, which is what... Does it let me see? Oh, 56. Which seems not bad. Um, it's not gonna be enough to push him back, and I really want to do this like one at a time here. So why don't we do this? I don't think that'll, because it doesn't technically stun him, right? Yeah. So no, that's that. We're good there. Um, I'm tempted to do big ol' cleave here. Uh, most of these buffs are only one turn. But then I could also do like a double... Maybe I should save the, um, the double turn for my shield, uh, beefer upper robot thing. Just in case things get real hairy. So why don't we... let's see... Yeah, let's do a uh, big ol' hit there, and then I guess the biggest hits we've got, right? And then I guess the only real attack thing we've got with our healer is this, so, uh... Eh, should be fine, right? Okay. Let's open up with essentially a free turn. Okay, that's good. That took down like a third of his shields, at best. Oh, and we can't break him in the next turn, unfortunately. Uh, that's a problem. I mean, the other option is to uh, stun, right? But the problem with that is going to be uh, retaliates on a stun, so meh. <laughs> Maybe we just take the hit here. Because what's... Oh god, that's gonna almost myrtleize my healer immediately. So I could just defense, right? That'll at least reduce the amount of dump that's gonna happen here. Then I could give her shields back immediately thereafter, right? That seems good. Um, although... Shit. Ah, uh, that's gonna be a, a real big hit, though. Because then it's... If, if he hits before we move, then it's an extra 130. Which, uh... Could murder me. Actually, so let's see. At, at, at its worst, it's going to be 390. Uh, which murders my healer. And probably my uh, budget Han Solo. And my robot friends. The only one it really doesn't murder is my frontliner. So everybody's got to go before him. Otherwise, we're fucking toast. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Um, 
so this might be the time to be like, hey, let's, uh... Because now I'm curious, is it worse? Is his counterattack on stun worse than his normal attack? Because if it isn't, that might be the way to go. But man, it's hard to tell. So I think, I think what we'll do then is do this. We'll do that, we'll let our uh, robo friend go twice here. I'm gonna have him do, I guess, that first, right? This goes immediately. Or no, wait. Oh, yeah, this go Like, both of these things are happening, like, immediately, huh? So, okay. Like, if it does, uh... Oh, then I see. Then it goes back to, like, normal. Normal stuff. And then we could speed our shit up if we needed to. Leading six which is not blocked by either shield or armor, so that's really doing uh, 26 plus 13 plus 20, which isn't bad. Plus it also pierces some of his armor, which is even better. Guess the alternative is to defend here, I suppose, right? Defend here. So at least prevent her from getting murdered in one go, pretty much. Um, we'll do a sever there, that seems fine, and then we're up to just these two. Which I think at this point is gonna be... Just shoot them? Just shoot. And then... If I do this... Okay, so it's not gonna count as... a crit hit against him, because he already acted, right? So let's go ahead and then rebeef the shields on our... Uh, healer. Once this dude gets his turn. So bonk bonk there. Gonna take the 20 to bleed eventually. There's his attack. Oh god. Oh, that's a rough hot. Uh, that's a rough hit there, but that's it's fine. It's fine. Get our shields back on our healer to not die. <laughs> There's the 20 bleed. Oh, and he gets to go immediately. I don't like that. Um, but everybody's still alive, so that's fine. Uh, now this is a big-ass problem. So he's gonna do... What is he doing there? Oof. Oh, he's gonna go right against our uh, front runner there, so I'm gonna need to push him back pretty severely here. Also gonna need some shields on my front runner again. It should prevent most of the damage. So let's get let's push him back. Firstly, let's push him back. Fuck you. Give us some time to work with here. Thank you. Um, and then we can be like, oh, let's do um shields on our front runner. Oh. Which is still gonna... Oh man, that's still gonna be rough. So if I do that... If I do that, and then if I also do... Even if I do defense here, like, what does that actually do, though? What would that actually do? It just says defense plus 15%, but I don't think I've ever seen that actually take effect. Well, no matter, I guess. I think either way I'm gonna have to break this fucko into next turn. But if that- well, if I'm gonna break him into next turn anyways... Oh, I should probably still regen her shields. Never mind. Okay, let's break him into next turn. She'll get her shields back. Uh, what is that? Oh, faster attacks and more crit damage. Um, 
probably fine. Probably fine to do this. Oh, except that. That should still push him back, right? Oh, he's already been pushed back. Right? I think. I don't think it's gonna matter, is it? But I think this goes first, technically. But that should still push him back far enough, right? Yeah, okay, we're good. We're good, and then we'll get the... the sort of good slam there, and then shields back up here. Oh, and then he gets to go pretty much right away. <laughs> Fucking hate it. Ugh, what is he doing? Oh, he's just attacking my front runner, which is uh, still kind of a problem. So either way, she's like taking, let's see, what is that? 116 plus 58, be 170 some. Ouch. So I might be best off doing a defend, which will reduce the uh, the dumb there for sure. Can I also maybe if I do a defend and then also this, would that be good? We're gonna power that up a bit and then also do a defend. And I don't, I see, I don't know that that's gonna do anything, but we're gonna do it anyways, I think. Uh, and then what? I guess give her her shields back again. Or maybe we wait. We just try to keep pounding away at this jackass here. Alright. Let's do that, and then... You know what? Let's put some explosives. And then he'll go... Ouch. But only 38 health lost. Armor's gone entirely. That's not great, but we'll do what we need to do. Okay. Oh god, then he goes immediately again. Ouch. Okay, but he hit the hit our budget Han solo with that. Which is probably fine. Looks like everybody's gonna live. Uh, okay, now would probably be the time to... Push him back. Push him back with what we have, right? And then just work on getting everybody back up to speed. As best we can. I think that's the way to do this here. So that'll guarantee you, guarantee to push him in the next turn. It's not gonna do that much damage, but it's something. Um, and now that gives us a turn to kind of redo our stuff a little bit. Let's get Budget Con Solo protected again. Um, 50% damage there. Honestly, most of these are not gonna really do anything. Cause I don't, I don't want to hit him hard again. I want to kind of use this one to be like, yeah, all right, let's just let's defend a bit. It's kind of been pushed into next week here. Are we not gonna get a? We are gonna get a crit, so I don't wanna. I don't wanna push this. Do I? And I don't wanna use that because that's just this turn, and we're we're done doing our thing. So let's just do it. Like that. Okay. Let's get our stuff. So now he's ready. He's ready to just fucking burn us a bunch here, which is uh. Not super good. So it looks like we're gonna take some big hit here. Everybody's taking a big hit. Thanks. Oh, it's just on a random target. I thought this was a group hit. 
Okay, that... Hmm, I don't like that it's random. <laughs> All right, well, that in mind, then. Um, looks like we're not gonna... Okay, let's push him back. This gives us the rest of this turn to kind of think about what we're doing. And then, if we do... Well, I don't know. Uh, Titan Strength plus a big-ass hit here. That'll take his shields down entirely, which is great. And we can start pounding away at health. So let's do... Because it looks like ev whoever gets targeted by his thing is going to survive. That's the important part here. So let's go ahead and give huge strength boost here. Oh, and it doesn't end his turn. Great, that's even better. Um, and then also... <laughs> Regen our front runner shields, right? And then big hit here. And now I don't know what to do about this now. I guess just a normal hit here. Cause either way, either way this fucker's get tagged like three times, so one fuck you. <laughs> oh right, that goes through shields regardless. Uh shields up. Good, ready. And then big hit here. Woo! Nice. Big hit there. His shields are gone. He can now burn and bleed and do whatever. Oofa. Oofa doofa. Uh, that's a big hit across the board. But it's fine. He's on fire and he's bleeding and oh... Ouch. My poor healer. <laughs> uh... Hmm. Okay. You know what? That's okay. That's alright. Uh, this will get him into next turn again. I could do shields and bleeding here. Or I could do burning and bleeding here. Which should be excellent. Uh, what's he at right now? 1148. Okay. Um, oh, it looks like our healer could eat it this turn. Uh, unless we defend and then she's just barely holding on. Uh, okay. But, is he, is that an, that's an AoE, yeah? It's hard to tell. Like, it doesn't have, like, the random shit on it, but... Okay. Okay. We go like that. Right? Get our shields back there. I'm actually gonna, uh... We're gonna wait on this. Because I have a feeling that if we do that... If we do this, this this acts right away. Oh, but it doesn't. Okay, it doesn't stagger him. That's actually pretty okay. So do that. Bonk. Oh, that does eat his turn now. Ah, I hate it. Ah, oh, whatever. All right, and then do big hits here. That'll push him out to next turn. And we're still good on our shield aura, so we may as well just be like, uh... I guess we'll just beef up our front runner, because that's an extra quarter crit damage. So yeah, do that. Then bonk, 97 is a pretty big hit and burning, and bleeding, and all of that fun stuff. Ah, well, then what's he doing? Oh, he is hitting everybody. <laughs> Everybody's taking a big hit there. I don't like that. Um, well... Alternatively, we could be like, no, fucking back your shit up. I think I'm required to do this, honestly, even though it does a uh, very just light tap on damage and it doesn't push him into next week the way it is, but I don't have an attack that can push him the next week in one go here anyway, so, alright, let's back that up, give us some room to work, 
Ah, uh, just barely. Okay. Now, I think we're probably going to... Well, I can bestow shields on myself. That's pretty alright, actually. Because if I then do... Because how much does that speed us up, stimulate here? Uh... 10 seconds faster. So if we do that... Then her big hit gets to go, like, right away. Or before that guy goes, so... If we do that, let's line that up. And then be like, hey, no. Move that back 10 seconds, she gets to go, gets to do a big hit. Destroys the rest of his armor. Oh, but everybody is, like, extremely hurt. <laughs> everybody is very hurt here. So we're gonna need to do this in, like, two turns. Otherwise, we're fucking toast. Unfortunately, I don't have, like, just a straight-up healing move here. But if we do that... I still need to decide what to do with him. Um... Because what, what are our shields at right now? Nobody's really great. If I shield up myself here, I think mean, he's taking less of a hit. I still don't know what he's gonna do. Okay, gut angle, I guess, huh? That should be fine? This should be fine. So let's, you know what, fuck it, let's go for it. Beep up ourselves a little bit. Defend, and then big hit. 153 is a good hit. Armor's gone. Still on fire. Oh, God. Oh, it's a big hit. Everybody's shields are toast. Hmm. <laughs> oh, and he gets to go again. So I think uh, our healer is dead. Yeah, that's not fair. Well, rip. Uh... <laughs> fuck. Um... Okay, it looks like he's just going single target on our front runner now, which is fine. Uh... So now we, we have to, like, slam super hard here. So, okay. Realistically, the best we can hope to do now is just slam away. <laughs> it's pretty much just slam away. Oh, and then get shields back, and hopefully he's just gonna target our front runner now. Because we can keep this up. We can keep beefing the shields on our front till the day is done, right? It's just when he does those fucking Massive slam group attacks is a big fucking problem. Mm. Yeah, okay, so now his attack is still going against that. But in order to not fucking lose another person, I think we need to keep our shields regenning a little bit. <laughs> Otherwise, we're fucking toast. Um, can we get. Okay, we can get burning and bleeding going there. So let's do that. And then, I mean, just straight up slam him now, right? Oh, God. Still took a massive fucking health hit there, too. I hate it. Oh no, and he gets to go again! Ah, oh, okay, well, good thing we shielded our, uh, budget Han Solo there. Oof. Okay, well, I think we're probably toast here. 
no matter what happens. But, well, what does Cataclysm do? Cataclysm does a pretty big hit, and it pushes him back. So if we lean in, just lean the fuck into the next turn and a half here, we might be able to tell this fucker to take a hike. Or if I do this first. So that'll do that first, that'll push him into next week. That'll uh, reduce his defense by 25%. And then we do the big boom combo slam here. <sighs> and then hope we've got enough time in the next turn to, to really let him have it. Huh. Okay, yep, we do have ample time here. How much do we have to do? What does he have? 237? Okay. Can we do 237? There's 105. Plus bleed and burn. Or plus burn, I guess. Uh, what is he doing? Oh, he's doing a group attack again. I hate that. Um, there's no way. Well, I guess the only way. Well, we don't have any stun attacks now. There's 40. And then there's another 60. So that's not gonna. That's not gonna murder him, I don't think. But, if we... Oh god, that's gonna... That's still gonna kill him, huh? Really? Alright, hold on a second. Let's, let's try to queue these up and see what happens if this changes. No, he's still gonna get murdered. I think. But he's gonna have all his shields back. So, alright, maybe then we defend. And then also give him his shields. Will he survive? It looks like he'll survive, at least. <laughs> then that leaves pretty much just our, our front runner to do a big boom slam, and then we hope that next turn we can end this. Because what's this doing? This is doing 105 plus burning 13. So 118. Or we can do 39 plus 13 plus 20. That's not going to do it. Okay. I think it's big boom slam time. And then hope that next turn we can finish the job. <clears throat> Four is a good hit. Plus burning, plus bleeding. Oh god! <laughs> oh, he's still alive though. Ooh, he is hanging in there. Oh no, he gets to go again. Okay, good thing it's just a debuff and not an actual hit. Oh, all right, we need to murder him now. Absolutely need to murder now. Oh, he's going to return fire on shit, too. But she'll survive. She'll survive. Uh... Fuck. <laughs> uh... What happens if we just... If we just let him sit, though... If we just let him sit, he won't counterattack, right? Because it looks like he doesn't have... Oh, but he's gonna fucking heal. He's gonna heal for 375. Ah. Ah, nuts. Um. Well. Okay. If we give her shields... 
give her shields first, and then she does big boom slam. She'll take less of a hit. <laughs> uh, okay. But then what? Then what can I do here, though? I guess I can put explosives on there? Yeah, because that'll do some amount of damage. Hopefully without provoking like a return fire type shit again. Let's do that. So he'll, he'll just do that, whatever. And then we shield up here. And then big boom slam from front runner. Does the counter. Oh god. Painful. But then he gets to fucking heal up for 375. Oh no, what's that doing? Ow! Oh, oh, he's still alive though. Oh, but he's stunned. Oh no. <laughs> oh fuck. Um, okay. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> it's just. We're back to just... Oh... Okay, we need to get him off this fucking turn. The only way we're gonna do that... Is... Okay, that'll push him out. But he'll still have, like, fucking... 20 bajillion health. <laughs> ah! Fuck you, ass! <laughs> get out of here! Okay, he's on fire again, which is good. Oh, but now he gets to go, like, almost immediately, and he's gonna murder... somebody. He's gonna murder my front runner. I... Oh, wait. Is that is she still getting murdered? Yeah. Even on a defense, she's still getting murdered. Alright, I don't think I have a... I don't think I have a choice here, do I? Ah, oh, crap. I think I'm toast. Because what's that going to do? Yeah, it's just going to do, like, chip damage. 56 plus whatever. Ah, oh, which is going to be so... Because even if I try to give her shield, it's, it's going to be too late. It's going to be too late. I think she's dead. And I think that's going to be the end of it. Well, actually, the option... <laughs> we have just barely enough for this. What's going to happen if we do this? Because he doesn't like being stunned. Like, what's he going to fucking do? What's his deal? Retaliates with deadly force. I... Like, that's the only possible thing I can do here to prevent my frontrunner from getting killed. So let's do it. Let's see what happens. Now, does that actually stun him and he can't go until next turn? Oh, shit. Okay. We do that, and then we do Big Boom Slam. That should be the kill. Did we accidentally save this? Okay. Big hits, big hits. And boom. There's the kill. Oh, our poor healer, but we survived. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, I imagine she's... I figured this would operate on, like, a Fire Emblem style, like, once they're dead, they're toast, right? But... Maybe... Maybe she survived? Alright, so fuck that one. Okay. Uh, apparently our, uh... Our healer is not dead. Oh, permanent injuries. Oh, good. What does that mean? Revive fallen heroes back to life, but only with one health. Okay, that's fine. All your heroes are killed in combat. You'll have no choice but to retreat, and your mission will have failed. Okay. Never mind. 
Um, revived heroes will sustain permanent injuries that can weaken their abilities and power for the remainder of the mission. You can remove all permanent injuries from your squad by finding and activating health stations. Okay. Okay, so never mind. That was less problematic then. Woof. That was a rough fight. Okay. We, we did it. So what does our... Now what does our healer have, though, going against her? Uh, it doesn't really say. Oh, no, for the rest of the mission. So the mission's over, so she's back to full health. Okay. Excellent. So, alright. I guess that was probably the best outcome we could have hoped for. How much we got? 73. Alright. Um... I feel like I should save it for our <laughs> um, cancels debuffs and blah, and slow rush, cover fire, blah, blah, breaks, breaks guard seems pretty good, huh? Uh, let me look at his stuff. Uh, skill tree, there we go. Here. Um... Doesn't seem to really to do very much. It's a light attack. I guess it does six to armor break? To armor damage, rather? But not much, I would think. Although, oh, okay, there we go. <clears throat> Minus 25% to armor defense, more stagger, and uh, lowers health defense as well if shields are down. That's not bad. What does he get here? Uh, level 6. Locked by shields and armor. Uh, but not a bad, like, normal ass attack for him, really. It's pretty instant, isn't it? Okay, and what does she get? Level 6 and Path of Surge. Cancels debuffs and damage over time effects, and also does shield regen. Oh, oh we could use that! Make our healer a bit... You know what, before we do that, actually, we should uh, get another... another person on the team. Who, who wants to sign up for, a uh, for a Batul here? Guardian? Uh, can I... I wish I could look at details here before we recruit people, since we can only recruit one. Or a Marksman. Uh... The marksman is temp. <laughs> Although, we have to consider, though, our back row is already full. So... Whoever we get will be joining our front runner in the front row, which is probably unideal. That kind of maybe says Guardian to me, then. So let's see. Let's see what we got. Okay, yep. Yeah. Big big health. Big health, which is good. Good for front row. Um let's see about level ups now. I don't know what that other meter below the health is though. It's like maybe energy field or something. Should be alright. But if that's going to also be a front runner, we should probably distribute the level there. Okay. And do it. Um, what do we have here? In concussion damage. Uh, elemental damage buffs. Kind of into that. 
Um, it's a free action, which is great. Uh, three elements. Oh, okay, so now we're talking about elemental damage across the board, which I love. <clears throat> now we've got a flurry style attack as well. Single target attack. Okay, so the attacks themselves are not super good, but... Protects all allies from damage. Great. That's what you want a front runner to do. Uh... There's the elemental damage types. Um... And also concussion damage, which is great. Uh, and we also have Warp Storm, that's AoE. Strong, slow AoE attack. Alright. Another... Level 7 gets another element, and then we get some other stuff, too. Okay. Seems good. Uh, do we have any equipment that we can give you? No, we're really light on equips. But we've got money. We've got 192 buckos. Let's see what we can spend our money on. Um, gadgets? No. Weapons first. Always weapons first. Oh, look at that stuff. Um... I don't think anybody can use any of this, because these are all level 7s required. But we could pick up... Oh, that's probably for the marksman over there. Um... We could anticipate, perhaps, one of our folks being level 7, like, mid-mission next time. Oh, that is tempting. Most of these are tempting. But okay. Well, maybe maybe some other stuff is more... Oh, these are all level 7s, except for this one. Which, armor. Can't say no to armor, really. <clears throat> but extremely good... Extremely good vest. Plus 24 to armor. And also regen shields. <laughs> on self and then across the board for everybody else, that's sick as hell. Um, or like a fucking great... Uh, damage booster. It's really hard to balance offense and defense here, considering how very dangerous that last fight was. I think definitely giving one of our front runners some more uh, defense would be helpful. So let's anticipate a level 7 at some point. And we can't afford anything else. <laughs> And now we can't afford anything else. Oh, no. But alright, you know, that's fine. We've made our choices, right? And we gotta live with them. And we gotta live with them. Phew. Okay. Ah, look at that motherfucker. Goliath now. So we murdered the Chimera. We murdered DMN20. Now we gotta go murder the Goliath. Let's, let's do it. Now everybody can have a good time with uh, our new front runner here. Um, okay, well, we working on anybody in particular here? Could do damage causes bleeding, maybe to our healer here. Kind of been working that up. We've been doing more damage with. Probably our spiritual robot dude. That only costs one, which is good. Uh, armor piercing is pretty good. <laughs> Just a straight up damage and defense buff is pretty good. Oh, can we only do that to one person? Oh, there. I was pressing the wrong direction. Okay, there we go. Uh. Oh, no, that's the wrong one. Oh, right, because they need to be a certain level to use some of these. 
Okay, you know, just straight up damage and defense. Sure, why not? And do it. Um, and then we could turn favor, I guess. Be like, hey, yeah, you need to cause more crit damage and bleeding and shit. Here. And that should... Does that get us to level 3 there? Or... Yeah, there we go. <clears throat> Pleasing robot appearance. <laughs> there we go. Now everybody, everybody's cool. Plus we get 40 more health. And shield regen. Oh, that's sick as hell. Alright, I'm gonna do it. And two more action points. Um... Oh, plus we get to do, like, the free shit here, right? Could have done that first, oh well. Hey, remember that time we murdered that guy? Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. What else we got, then? Okay, food and stuff, I don't care. Uh, max shields. Can we... Does that work? Since our fresh recruit doesn't have shields to begin with, does that do a thing? Probably not. Attack strain shield, attack speed, which isn't bad. Oh, we can't do that one anyways. Um, attack strain shield, sure, yeah, do that. Alright, any f more free actions we can do? Oh, well, besides that, I suppose, but... Nope. Need to do that. Okay, well... God, that one boss battle took like 45 minutes! <laughs> That's right, we were trying to be careful with it. That was the... that was the point, I think. We are trying to be careful. Um, oh boy. Level 9, huh? Oh, crap. Level 8, level 8, level 8. Don't know what that fucker is. Level 9, level 10, oh. Level 9. Oh, this is probably not shaping up great. Ooh. Okay, so here we are, in the next little area, I guess. Stop them here and now, we stop them forever. Well, I've heard that story before. Uh... Okay. <sighs> Alright, what do we got to deal with? We could do some, just, some basic bitch fights. To hopefully get our levels up. Wouldn't be a bad idea be a bad idea at all, really. <sighs> okay, here's big boy number one over here, level eight. My god. Alright. Uh... Another level eight. Big bad up there. There's a level nine. Oh! <laughs> oh, but he's guarding. Guarding some good shit, though. Oh. Okay. Well, what are our options here? We can go there. Kind of take a... Two light fights here, right? One, two, and then maybe do this one. So we can get some... Or at least unlock that armor station for later. Alternatively, we could go here, and then here, and then here, so three lightish fights, right? Okay, there's a heal over there, so that'd be day one, and then it'd be one, one, two, we could probably go fight this fucker on, on the end of day two, level eight, oh boy, that would be a odd rough fight, I think. That would be day two, and then I guess one, two, oh, to three here. That would be day three. Uh, tempted by this, but uh, this fucker guarding it 
Gives me a little bit of pause. So, all right. I, th I think we we go around this way to go one, two, three over to here. It'll be two probably easily doable fights. Three easily doable fights plus this little thing at night, which will be like extra money or something. Then we'll have a heal just waiting for us for the beginning of next day. Then one, two, three. This dude at the end of day two. And then one, two. Wait. Oh, we'd have to go up this way, I think. One, two, three. And then it'd be the big bad. Okay, seems good. I think that's a plan. Good plan. Well, maybe not a good plan, but it's a plan. And plan. Alright. What are we dealing with here? Okay, they get to do a, a defense, I guess. What are we dealing with? Okay, he's defending that fucker. Looks like our front runner is taking two hits there. I don't like that. I see. Okay, they're not letting me see this other one. I guess it's just defending him. Okay, we've got. Le oh, that is the Sentinel right there, never mind. And there's that guy, so Sentinel's level 7. Everybody else is level 6. We got a repair bot, huh? I don't like that. I really don't like that. Alright. Hmm. He's got an AoE going too, which I also do not like. Oh, but it looks like we're gonna be striking first no matter what. Okay, so let's see. We've got... Uh, which one of these is AoE? There we go. Pretty not bad AoE. 35 across the board. We just need to do something about those first dudes. Oh, and we can't target most of these fuckos the way it is. Alright, so we can push that guy back. A little bit. have a pretty big o AoE here. That's an early AoE. Ah, I hate that this dude's absorbing most attacks. Any of these? It's a single target, but it's not pushing them back at all. I'd almost have to do this. I almost have to do that. Oops, I forgot that took effect immediately. <laughs> Damn it. Well, I mean, whatever, it's fine. Um, and then we can do big AoE, which uh, pushes most things back as well. Also, almost murderize this one here. Also get ready for AoE on this too, huh? That seems pretty wise. How's everybody doing here as far as what's gonna happen to them? I'll take it looks like light health damage across the board. Must we do something about it, right? Okay, we can at least get one of them out of here entirely. Let's do that. Push him into next week. Bonk. Fuck you, idiot. Um, and now we get to be like, yeah, kaboom, bam, boom. <clears throat> Big AoE hits. Every Most people are on fire. Big hit there. Oof, big hit there. Oh, the health steal thing. Fuck you, man. I don't like that. Okay. 
Alright, seems fine, I guess. Alright, do we have any instant hits here that we can do such that we can reflect damage, huh? Oh yeah? How are you gonna reflect the kill shot, jackass? <laughs> Alright, who's the one I need to worry about here, though? I think it's this fucker, right? Who's going first? One of these two dudes is going first. I don't like it. Um, I could do this right away? No. Do you have any, like, really quick AoE? I guess the quickest AoE I've got is this one. But it's not gonna... It'll do such a tiny amount of reflect damage there. I don't think I care. Um... Oh, it's this. Reaction. I could do this immediately. It's the only one that can target there. It sucks. Uh, attack scheme nitro damage? I'm kind of into that. Oh, I see. Okay. So we we build up energy and then we can use that energy to do cool things to that guy. Okay, I'm into that. Um, well, if we do this, that'll fucking just... It's an easy fucking bonk, 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 boom, bomb. That guy's fucking toast. Alright. Then... Um, who's the dude? Okay, whoever's- okay, that's the dude that's doing that. I don't like that necessarily, but I don't think I have any guard against it unless I do 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 Well, I could defend, right? That's the deal. If I defend, then she's taking less damage, I guess. And then we could work on... this guy back a bit to let our AoE dudes do the work. So like that. And then we've got just this, which is going to be a single target. Should kill that dude before he gets to go. I'm into it. Oh, okay. Only 17 health. That's not bad. I can work with that. So, bonk. Push you back a little bit. Oh, you're toast. Okay, very good. Um, big AoE hit there. Okay, and then it retargets to somebody else, which I'm into. And then pushes him back, too. I'm into it. Okay, and then... We get to be like, no, fuck you. Give us a give us a moment here to think. Bonk. Still the matter of that other dude there, which uh, concerns me. But I think we're gonna get a kill shot regardless of what happens here. So. Be extremely sure that these idiots are dying. <laughs> there we go. Bonk. Is that a kill shot there? Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Okay, so... Uh, uh, probably took more health damage there than I wanted to, but that's alright, I guess. Um, that does let us level up, and I wanted to- oh, not either of the two that I wanted to actually level up so they can use the fancy vest we just bought. So I guess we'll wait. That's fine. Okay, next go is probably down here then.
Looks like they're roughly the same enemies here. Uh, okay. Um. Are we gonna be fast enough that we can get our shield regen instead? Yeah. It's that guy we can just move out immediately. Oh, it's the dude in the center. That's the big problem, huh? Well, he's really fast. What is he gonna do? What's that mean? Okay, he's just targeting our rope friend there, that's fine. He'll survive. So realistically then, what I want to do is maybe just push them all back a bit. That'll push them to most of them to beyond ha the halfway mark there. At which point we can kind of push the rest out of here as we need to do. So if we queue that up, that's where they're going to end up. I'd love to get this big, this big boom AoE out there, but I don't think that's going to happen. Actually, what's going to happen with this guy is he's going to get hit. He's going to take a very minor amount of shield not much. I suppose we could do the whole explodey bits here again. Alternatively, I could make sure... Wait, did I not... Right, I can do this to him. That's pretty good. So we could get him off the field entirely, which, uh... You know what? Kind of into that do that. Well, not off the field, I guess, just in the next week. That's fine. Okay, good. Gives me a little bit more time, then. Now we can work each of these separately. It's still not enough. Uh, can I... Okay, I can push this guy back a little bit. And then also... Then that lets us AoE the rest... Pretty much out of here, although that's gonna be a big ass... Big ass hit in our front runner there, which annoys me. So maybe we defend instead and work on everybody else getting them off the field. Uh, that's nearly... If we don't do that, that's probably two-thirds of our health. This dude's health is just going away. I don't like that. <laughs> that makes me nervous. Um, because we've got one more fight to do after this one. So yeah, let's defend. Big hit there, good hit there. He's not going away, but big hit there. That one's moving into next week. We get two of them that act here. Ouch, 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 ouch. Also ouch. Ugh. Hate it. Ugh, they get to go, like, forever. Um... So I could do... Big attack there. 70. 70 plus 25. Ah, oh, man, I... Okay, that... If I can murder 
that dude at the front right away. I know that I'm gonna have fast enough attacks to do that, though. Unless I do speed everybody up, but even then my fastest person can't do it. Ah, oh, I hate it! Either way, whoever's getting attacked there is going to take one on the chin. Yeah, our other front runner there. Oh. Okay, well. Well, if that's not going to matter then. With the extra speed, it's not going to matter, so we may as well just... Maybe defend our front runner a bit, that might help. Cause who's who's all attacking him? Those two in the back, huh? Just that one and also that. This is the important one to push into next week there. I think we can do that fairly easily, right? We would need to hit him at least twice. We'd probably do here. Do it like that, and then... Well, that really wouldn't push him back, would it? This one would top of giving us a little bit of time to work on the other ones, right? Okay, I think either way. So we might be able to myrtleize this dude late. Yeah, there we go. So I'll get to attack, but that'll be pretty much it. <laughs> ouch, ouch. But no, no damage to health there, which is kind of impressive. That should be the kill. Oh, well, that's not the kill shot, but maybe the, um... The burner, the bleed will take care of that. Ugh. Okay, no, that attack will do it. There we go. Big hitter in the back is waiting for next turn, which is great. Oh, except they are all going very fast. I don't like that. Uh. <laughs> Alright, which one of you is that? That's probably the first dude to go. I need to get that guy out of here. I need to murder him immediately. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. Well, unless I do like a big attack here. Do a small attack there and then we can do like instant attack there. That takes him off the board. Nice, okay. And then our kind of quick AoE will take him out and move the rest back a little bit. It's only going to be doing 44. This was the big dude that I wanted to take out immediately because otherwise he's going to really ruined my robot friend's day there, so let's go ahead and do that. I'm gonna kill shot on that guy as well. And then, you know. Simply doesn't matter there. Oh, we got a kill shot there too. So I think everything is gonna die in this next turn. It's not gonna matter. Whoever 
whoever gets the kill, right? Alright, so there goes that guy in the back. Fuck you. That guy should be toast now, too. Yep. And that one should be toast now as well. Alright, good. A few problems. Oh, it looks like our our guardian frontrunner there heals at the end of each battle. That's fucking great. I'm into that. I'm really into that, in fact. That, that's the one I was worried about really taking a bunch of hits. He doesn't have any shields or armor. Um, okay, now we can, uh, <laughs> I feel like I want to upgrade my pro tag, right? Then she can wear the fancy vest. But, but then also, <laughs> I could give armor to my other front line person here. Hmm. Hmm. Plus 24 armor, really. Or I could give that excess armor to my real big front runner here. Be like, yeah, you deserve this since you're doing the most work, probably. Um, you know what? I'm gonna I'm do that. So here, let's do that. And then we can be like, hey, here's that fancy vest we bought. Look at that, 40 armor. Excellent. And do it. Okay. And I think our plan then was to do this one last. Another fight. Probably not too terribly problematic a fight, but we'll see. And then that'll be the end of day one. Uh, okay, at least these folks don't look too bad. Oh, one of them gets to go immediately. Oh, it's guarding some bullshit. And I don't know what the other one's doing. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't know. I don't like what either of these fuckers are doing. Probably just guarding. Guarding center shithead there. Okay. Huh. Well, that gives us some things to do here. We can do... Only target that one. Is that... Figures. Or we could target that one. I know that that's... Well, they're, neither of them have actions queued anyway, so it's not like we could do anything about it. Try to push that one back, but I think he's guarded by that one up there. So given that speed is not a thing, let's get our shield regen up. And then I guess maybe just try to fertilize this one first. 201. 201 shields. I don't like that at all. I'd really like to take out the shithead in the back, at least push him into next week so we've got some time to think about this. That would really be the only thing we can do. Hmm. Oh wait, what is... Okay, we could maybe do like two big AoEs. Well, one AoE to push him back the first time, and then a bigger AoE push the back dude into next week, which is good. And now that reduces what's going to happen to our folks. It's also good. It 
also make this go faster and do more damage. Uh, so yeah, why don't we do that? And then we can do like a, not maybe a big boom slam, but... Well, actually maybe we could. Really lay into the, one of the shieldy idiots, I guess, yeah? Eh, let's do that. And then get ready with an AoE there. Okay, big boom slam, that dude's into next week. One dude will go. But not, you know, terribly problematic. Pretty big slam there. Okay, and now we get to go... Kaboom, right? 56 will... Kill one outright. Do a big amount of damage to the rest. So yeah, get out of here, fucko. Excellent. Um, and now it's really a question of can we go fast enough to murder the dude in the back? I think that's... Whoever's attacking our healer, this one here. Are we fast enough to do this? Alternatively, are we fast enough with a speed boost to do this. The answer appears to be no. This will go immediately. That's not enough. All that's too slow. Well, not true. We could do this. Oh, but only to the front, dude. Shit. Uh, well? Can we murder the front dude right away? <laughs> um... I think if we do that... Oh, that's gonna go right away. Uh, Alright, hold on a second. Back to shield regen. Because I don't want to do this right away, right away. That's gonna do, what, 56 plus 20, 76, whatevers. Realistically, he should die. But if I do that plus that, he's probably guaranteed to die? Let's see. I guess we can queue that up first. And let's see. Yeah. So that'll kill him. But he's not the one that's going first. That's what worries. That's, that's the worrisome part of that. I really want to get the dude in the back to go the fuck away. I have her defend. She'll be safe from most of the damage. Oh, but... Maybe I can do it like this. Hold on a second. Uh, let's cancel all that. Let's go back to our speed up. Because Sever actually does... the thing, right? We could do that. We could then do this. That dude will be dead. Well, he won't be dead before I get to uh, this, because this takes effect immediately, doesn't it? Yeah, damn it. Alternatively, I just can't go like this. Now everybody fucking... Everybody's protected. <laughs> now we don't have to worry about shit. Uh, I'm into that. Immune to damage. That's fucking great. Plus, nobody's targeting our, our frontline guardian, so we're pretty much guaranteed to kill on everything here. Um, you know what? Let's cancel all that, because now, knowing that we can do this... Big AoEs...
I know that this dude's probably dying. I wonder that... Hold on a second. Okay, that dude's dying before our front runner gets to go. So then we can work this into whatever. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Immune, fucko. <laughs> Boom. Good, good slam there. He's fucking toast. Um, we get to do big AoE there. And then whoever this big slam hits... Oh, well, we're immune. Doesn't matter. Uh, whoever this big slam hits, which is gonna be this fucker, because he's front, I guess. Pretty much almost dead. Okay, and now it's just a matter of... You know what? Fuck everything. Make sure everybody goes in order. Whoever gets the kill gets the kill. Okay, good. Eh, everybody's pretty much did what they need to do. Now, we've got big ups we can do. We could do, well, let's spread this around a little bit. Most folks up to like level sixes, so. Um, the next three battles will probably give us enough to get probably at least one person to a level seven. Here, all right. Oh, what's that? It's an extra 25, and now we can do a final level up, get everybody to six. I'm into that. Whatever this is. <laughs> Please do not raid. <laughs> uh, oh, I thought that was gonna be like a we get an item or something. That's just flavor text, just narrative. Ooh. All right, well, whatever. Okay, so day one, pretty, pretty good. Pretty good. Nobody's in dire straits. Um, so we can probably afford... Oh, nice. We can just give somebody full health. That's great. Okay. Um, all right. Start working on our. Oh, they do that much. We could probably just try to. That's one point for that. Uh, health defense, we really don't need. Drain shields is fine. Stay healing. One third up would be alright too. Just top folks off. And shield defense. Do that actually. Not quite enough to get us that first little friendship level, though. <sighs> gonna do. Do you like just straight up damage defense boost? That's uh, useful no matter how you slice it. armor repair, huh? That's pretty fucking sick. I don't remember having that. Oh, that might be the, the thing we just got for the level up. That's great. I like that. Okay. Attacks cause bleeding, crit damage, and whatever. Uh, yeah. Alright. And we still got one bit here, don't we? I imagine we can just use this for whatever. If it, if it says, if it doesn't say it's going to be exhausted or expended or whatever, then we're, we're good to go. So I honestly would not mind having our healer actually do a heal. 
there. I really don't need to do any other heals at this point, but he's pretty okay. Okay. Dawn of the second day, 48 hours remain. Um, okay, so here's probably the plan. This one, and then this one, and then probably up here. Because I will want to make my way around here regardless, I think. And if that means maybe taking on that dude either at the end of this day or at the start of the next. So the alternative is to go over here, like one, two, three, do this big fight at the end of the second day. Um, we will have a heal here. Because I think we're going to need it to go after this fucker. I don't think we're going to be able to do two of the big boys be safe about it. That's what worries me kind of a little bit. But either way, I think we're doing this fight, so whatever. Let's do it. Ah, looks pretty uh, unthreatening. Okay, yeah, pretty unthreatening here. Um... What is... Oh, God, that's still very slow, isn't it? And they're all, they are all targeting my front row guardian there. Oh, well, except for those two. All right, they're, they're half seeds. They're, they're splitting it up half and half. So if I start working these dudes back, they're like, hey, fuck you. And then I do, uh, What? We don't need the speed, I don't think. I think we'll be fine. Uh, let's advance shields there, because I think she's going to move regardless where she is, so that's good there. Alternatively, I could make sure... Let's just double check on this. Damn, I wish I could queue this up for somebody behind them, but... It's not happening. So there's our other choice there, right? And we could just kind of pick them off. Ah, there we go. That's what I was looking for was another ability to move some of these fuckers out of the queue. like we can get two of them into next week. Whoops, that one fires right away, huh? All right, never mind. Okay, so he's out until the next turn. We can move this guy out of here entirely. Thing. 31, 52, but that's 31 plus bleed a 23. And 16, right? Seems good. Oh, I suppose alternative, if I do this, because what does that do? 10 seconds faster, okay. Because so I could do that. All right, let's let's undo that. Let's see what happens here. I think I would still need to maybe have him go, right? And then we would need to let's see. Is this this does push back another ten, but probably not enough to do anything about it. But if we do, perhaps well back to time order aura that gets us five for free and then stimulate gives another 10 to this one which would be still probably not enough okay never mind 
and I'm realistically not as worried about the attacks against our front guardian here. I really just want to get that fucker out of here. So if we do that, and then get that guy out of here, that's probably enough, and then there's just these two, really, right? Both of which are going against our front runner, so if we can maybe stun somebody else off of this planet, that would be good. What do we really have? Just these two, yeah? Hmm. Nitro damage. Is that going to be enough? rather just wait okay here's what we can do we can push this dude back and then we can do like the big boom slam aoe and that might okay that's not gonna kill anybody but i'll do a fair amount of damage i should shields down that causes for okay Burning and bleeding, excellent. That's what you like to see. 38 hit there, that's good. And big boom AoE there. Not gonna kill anybody, but also burning and bleeding, which is great. So one of these fuckers might actually die. This round, who knows? No, I guess not. But it does put him into a precarious position. Which is what I'm into. Okay. So there's an easy kill there. This front runner's gone. Um, I really wish. Okay, there we go. Really want to maybe do that first because then this one will do a kill shot against that fucker. Oh well, that's right. I forgot that that one always uh, kicks off immediately. I don't get to queue it up. Okay, but either way, then next attack on that fucker's toast anyway, so you know what, let's back that up a bit. Who gets to go first out of all this? That guy, I guess? No. Uh, middle dude. Can I myrtleize middle dude before he gets to go? I could get uh, front runner out of there immediately, which I can't. Well, no, that's not true. I could do big combo. Oh man, look at that. Big combo, just fucking quad kill this. Fuck it, let's do it. Ultra kill! <laughs> Wow, that's a... Boy, that's a rough combo. <laughs> I'm into it. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right, so we, then we got a free heal when we need it. But for now, we're good to probably just move on to this next battle. Oh, it's four on two. I like these odds a lot better. <laughs> hmm, I don't... Oh, I don't like that he gets the fucking... Oh, I don't like that! Ah, no! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, I don't like that. What are you doing? Stop! Oh, why do they get rockets and shit? Oh, crap -a -do. Um... All right, we need to not get hit by any of those. Especially that one, I would imagine. Plated rocket, plasma rocket, straight up warhead, okay. And then this jag off there, and then there's that dude. Like, what the fucking, damn it. <laughs> All right, uh, that in mind, then. 
we don't get to push that. Like, what is he doing? He recalibrate. What is he doing there? I don't know what he's. What does that mean? Whatever else are we facing here? Just straight up whatevers. Armed and ready to fire. Okay. I. I guess probably the center. This one here is probably the only one I give a shit about. Um, so I need that one to not be in this fucking... <laughs> I need this one to not be in this timeline. Um, alright. So there goes that. Plus we can probably just straight up push back. Very good. That one's no longer gonna be a problem in this turn. Um... I really wish I could target the center jackass here. I can do it like that, then I would have to maybe do... I'd have to do a, a group attack, otherwise it's not gonna work. Alright, so then I need to do... Probably push that guy back, and then... Big AoE attack here. And then whatever we're gonna attack here, I guess, huh? Can we really only target the, uh... Okay, well, I think we're not gonna kill shot all of these, so we may as well do some work against them, yeah? So boom, push that guy back. Alright, some work against that. Big AoE attacks there. That takes out the front rocket, right? Good stuff. Oh, okay, he's putting some shield on that one, that's fine. Also prepping that one to go. Oh, no. And then, um, do we have... Here. Fuck it. <laughs> uh, big boob slam, take care of the problems here. Fuck you. Boom. Takes care of big boy in the center, plus that rocket there. No prods. Now we get to do whatever. Just get rid of that one. And you know, whatever. Just kill that. Kill that, I guess. And then that should be it. Double kill. Excellent. Okay, end of that. Oh, all right, so now let's see what we've got. 138, uh, can we get two levels up out of that? We can get a blip and a blip there. I got trip sevens plus double sixes, I'm into that. Oh, plus a little extra here, whatever this is gonna be, huh, huh, huh? Another 70, which gets us another level up, probably. Oh yeah, budget ass Han Solo. Coming into level seven here. Uh, okay, and now we're on to day three, which we could maybe take this fucker here. Ooh, that's gonna be a rough fight, I think. But there's also some equips that I really, really want. Uh, so you know what? Fuck it, let's do it. Don't hesitate. Mmm. <laughs> Maybe I should have hesitated. <laughs> oh. Okay. What are we dealing with here? What's- Oh, God. Oh, this is a big AoE, AoE attack. Gonna kill my fucking frontline guardian. Um. Oh. <laughs> da crap. Um. Ah, uh, I need- 20 to protect myself, huh? Damn it. Okay, well, maybe we can tell him to fuck off until next turn, at least. <sighs> Frontline shit, though. Okay. If we do... How much is that gonna do? That's 10 seconds, yeah? And then how much does this do? 15, right? That's not gonna be enough. So what's, uh, what is that? That only does 10. That does 15, and I can't target the back row with that.
but uh, that's only single target to 10, but oh, an additional an additional delay, because he's weak versus concussion. Really? Excellent. Okay, that might be the play. I need him to not go this turn. <laughs> uh, so if I do that, and then I do, I think this is also a 15 delay, so that'll get him off of this timeline for now. What does he have in total? <laughs> lots. Lots and lots, and I don't like it. Um, okay, but I think we can probably give up our time bonus there. And still tell him to f*** off. So I would need to do this. This is an instant hit. That would push him off the timeline between those two attacks. Then I would need to uh, uh, push this dude here, right? Uh, okay, that would push him off entirely. I'm into that. That would leave those two. This guy would then do that. Yeah, okay. Except now I'm not 100% sure what would happen here. So I think either way this dude is probably going to take a hit. Uh, is that dude getting pushed back enough? Well... I could do... Single target, but he wouldn't be affected by that anyway, so we may as well just do... Big Boom Slam, take most things out. Oh, except... Oh, he's gonna die, huh? Uh... Well, no. This guy's gonna be pushed off the timeline, so he's not gonna die. And he's definitely doing the most damage. That guy's also moving off. What if I instead... ...move this guy off? I do big boom slam here. I guess I wait. Which one? Yeah, because I want to do that, and then I want to also do that. That takes care of business, right? So with that in mind, then we would need to go. Well, I Yes, this guy? I won't myrtleize him necessarily, but it'll do some good stuff. Okay, and then we need to make sure that that guy leaves the timeline. So, that. Okay, good. His shields are toast. Um, we get thing boom, 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 bam. Push him back a little bit off the timeline. Um, then we make sure that this guy goes in the next week. This guy gets a turn, whatever. Shields plus a little tiny bit of health, it's fine. And big AoE. Should also do burning? Or bleeding, or whatever? No, I don't know, whatever. No, small whatever there is fine. And bonk. Good armor break, and burning. Excellent. Okay. Oh, now it's just that fucker up there, though. Which worries me. I still can't really target him. Unless I do it like this. Again. Then I would really have to lay into him to have him not fertilize two of my five folks. Here. Okay. Uh, alternatively... I'm one short of this. I'm also one short of... 
big slamu here. So maybe my option is to... Alright, let's break this fucker right away, get the Fury up to really do Big Boom Slam, right? Ah. Uh, need 20 for the really big defend. Crap. Fuck. I need to stun. I need to stun that asshole. But in order to do that, <laughs> I need to move fast enough to... Well, let's see here. Well, okay, so we can speed things up by 10 seconds, or 15 if we turn on Time Aura. Uh, what can we do? Because I really want... <sighs> Actually, wait, does this do stun? No, this just does a massive amount of damage, but it does do um, 25 seconds stagger, so... Oh, boy. Who's the one I need to move off first here? Probably that guy. That guy. It's gonna have to be that guy. So we need to move... 10 plus 5 is 15 plus a little bit more. Are we gonna be able to do that? Because that'll move him back 10, and then an immediate... God, what can what else can we do that's an immediate attack? This, I suppose. Which would be that, but it doesn't doesn't do any pushback. I suppose the alternative is to maybe try to focus down this fucker for kill. Hold on a second. Uh, what gives me, by landing crits and breaks, crits generate one fury while breaks generate three fury. Okay, so any crit, any crit gets me the one fury that I need to be able to stun the fucker in the back. That's probably what I need. So in order to do that, we could run Time Aura here so that our spiritual robot dude will do instant hit here. Which will get us one fury, and then we can run our stun attack with budget on solo. Which will at least give get big dude off of this timeline. And... Fortunately, that kind of puts... Stronghold out of reach. Because even if we do... Well... I don't think anybody else has an instant hit attack here. Just this one now. It's also that. Because I could do that and not... And not trip the big dude's one, like, stagger thing. Which might be a good idea. That'll give me the one fury. I could stun the dude in the back. And then we're gonna have to think about what we're doing for the rest. This dude is probably next to focus down, because he's about to fire. Alright, well... Um, do I... Do I need my time bonus for that? 
and I put my shields back up. Okay, that's still an instant attack. So no matter what, I think we're safe here. Alright, let's do it. Okay. So there we go. Um, now we should have the appropriate amount of fury to be like, hey, fuck you, get off this timeline. Okay, now we've got some room to breathe. Um... Now it's really gonna come down to, can we murder this guy? And or... That's kind of the next one, really. I need to take out... One of these guys. If I do that... That takes that guy off of this timeline. And also hurts him a whole bunch, because it does burning and bleeding, which is good. Alternative is to try to eliminate this fucker, so let's cure, let's queue it up and see what we can do. Oh, we've also got this, which goes immediately. We have some, we have one other person to go here, so if we do... Okay, so we could push that guy off regardless, I think. And then we do a uh, Vorpal Swarm here. That would be our last attack. Uh, I think this will work. I think this will work. So let's do that. That gets some burning. Um, oh, oh, that doesn't eat the turn either. Uh, that's pretty sick. Well, then I could do a defend, and, well, I guess I just did a defend. <laughs> That's fine. Alright, so that dude will be burning. He's probably toast. And if not, he's gonna die next turn anyways, so whatever. We'll eat a little bit of health damage there. And there. Okay, yep, he's fucking toast. Uh, I am worried about this next turn. <laughs> Because now, uh, we've got a big problem. Although, that's not targeting my guardian anymore. Realistically, I want one of these fuckers to die, and preferably it's gonna be that guy gets moved out into next turn. So that leaves Robo Buddy unaffected. I think I'm into that. Then we get to kind of play a little bit with this one. I need something that does 20 plus seconds of stagger. Do we have anything like that? have that straight shot, but we can't target the dude in the back because he's being protected by these assholes. Uh, and I'd probably use this to stun this fucker off the, off the face of the earth anyway, so we'll probably can't do that. There's Sever. Which we can't target back row with anyways. We could do Sunder. Okay, there we go. That's what I was looking for. I would take out all of his shields, some of his armor, and push him into uh, next turn here. I'm into that. Okay, with that in mind then, uh, we've got our shield regen going, so let's push that guy off. And then dipshit in the back is getting pushed off eventually as well. We could do this too. Just to really pound it home. Uh, make sure we do that. And then 
kill shot there. Eventually, once our big AoE hits. And then we're up to... Oh, I don't know. Push that fucker back a little bit. And then... Corporal Storm there. Who is that guy targeting? Oh, just my front runner. It'll be fine. Just do that, and then let it play. Spawn there. This guy gets pushed into next week. And then big AoE hit here. That guy up top is toast, I think. Yep, yeah, good job. And then big AoE hit here. Excellent. And he'll get slight health recovery, that's fine. We'll make it work. Okay. Now. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, that's gonna be a big hit. Can we do anything about that? We can do another stun. Oh, oh, we already used our stun. Uh... And we can't do that, because that's 20. And I don't think we're gonna get a 20 for anything. Uh, so I think our front runner is gonna take a big hit, no matter what. Uh, the alternative is... Oh, that costs 20, doesn't it? Shit. Uh, we could do the kill shot there. And then try to focus down... What could we even do? We get the kill shot in the break, that's plus three. If we manage to somehow get two additional crits on big boy in the back there, before he gets to go, or like instant, I guess, right? It would have to be instant. Which means I would have to do this. I'd have to do that, and then another instant attack, which is this. Oh, but I wouldn't be able to do... Actually, what could I do with this? Hmm... Well... Technically speaking, that's a crit, right? Let me think about this a bit. If I do that, that's plus one. If I do this, that's plus two, maybe? Because of uh, two crits, technically? And then we would need two more. Which actually might be here for the break, right? Uh, but that's not instant. That's the problem. So it'd be here, or no, we would need to do uh, degeneration, right? That would be one. We could do two. Ah, see, that wouldn't do it. We would need a, an instant kill. What do we have that could do an instant kill? If we did the speed up, this would do it, actually. I think. So if we do that, and we've got instant attack here, would be, well, two crit, right? I really need need to break this guy out, but I can't do that unless I... <sighs> I think either way, this guy's gonna get to go. I hate it. Um, do I have anything? Yeah, all I've got really is Cataclysm. Oh, but he gets enraged at a combo. But! Oh no. Wait, what does that mean? Enraged when hit with a combo attack. I don't... That's probably not good. 
So maybe we just take the hit on the chin and move on. So with that in, with that in mind, then, let's go back to shield. Um, let's defend. Absorb some of the blow, right? Um, I do still want to murder this other one, though. She'll do that. That'll that'll get killed immediately, although I'd prefer maybe doing that, because that'll break and get me the thing. Get me the three fury and the, the kill, right? Could then charge up the big boom and slam on that fucko. He'll get to attack, which is fine, whatever. Um, let's do maybe the uh well yeah let's do that to at least do some of the armor break stuff right and i think that defends our folks even more so that's even better and then we're down to well i guess i could do that because then he'll crit Fertilize that thing, even while well, he's gonna crit that guy regardless, I think, so maybe we do even further defense here. She'll take that on the chin, no problem. 18 is a not unreasonable hit to take for that. So that fucker's dead. Now we get to just four on one this no, five on one, this fucko. Um, I think we can now ensure this guy goes to next turn. I would love to be able to kill him at this turn. I don't think that's gonna happen. That'll do a pretty solid amount there, so let's do that. Bonk. Good stuff. Now, getting to act next week. Um, and then... Big boom slam there, that'll take out the rest of the armor. guess we could try to prepare just in case he gets to go again next turn. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, kill AoE plus that seems fine, and then additional damage, right? Fuck it, why not? Here you go. Additional damage coming out there. <laughs> And burning, Oops, better. Big hit there, 104. Armor broken, very good. Don't like the region shield every turn. All right, what is the? Oh, that's an AOE. Oh, I hate it. <laughs> oh no, I hate it. Uh, well, I could just pop that and be safe. Or I could do this and stun and almost certainly guarantee the kill. Oh, but he gets enraged by combos. That's, okay, that's a bad idea. Uh, we can't push him back any further. So really, the big problem is going to be uh, avoiding all of that damage, which at this point, I think Stronghold is really the only choice. So there we go. We'll do that, and then everybody just goes to town otherwise. I think, I mean, everybody's gonna be returning fire on this fucker anyway, so let's do that. And then I big boom slam, maybe? Or do sever, because that'll do bleeding and burning. Get this one out of there right away, too. Leaves this, which if I do a 
Like, I could just improve it, really. Get an additional crit out of that. Even more, and then he'll be like, bop, 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 bop. And then, boom. Pretty good. Pretty good hits there. And now we've got you know, fresh stuff to deal with. That's fine. Okay. Now, we could just be like, you know, fuck you, man. Uh... Just... I, I guess do that, or we could wait to do that. That's a free action, too, so that's 70 plus. I think we'll probably have enough going here that we can pretty much ensure that this guy is going to be toast anyway, so we may as well be like, yeah, let's do that. Oh, damn. Sick as hell. Then do, oh, I don't know, uh, that one. Or is that? Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. We can also make sure that fucker dies. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Well, next hit is gonna get the kill. I have a feeling. So uh, maybe our healer gets the kill. <laughs> Bonk. Okay. Good stuff. Oh no, a healer didn't get the kill. Our frontliner gets the kill. Proteg gets the kill. Good job. Excellent. Alright. See you in hell, shithead. Uh, that guy goes away. Okay, that was turn three, huh? So we get free shit. Oh, look at that. Ah. Uh, oh, it's a level nine vest, but nobody can wear it. <laughs> oh, no. But we could get a much better S word. Um. Or just plus 40% damage straight away. I'm fucking into that. And. Oh. But she doesn't have any AoE attacks, does she? Oh, but that fucking vest, though. <sighs> Oof. If I could be guaranteed another level up, I would probably take this one, but I don't think I could be guaranteed that, so let's do this. Okay, no, need another 15 DNA to level her up, that's fine. Okay, but we can get folks to level 7 across the board, I'm into that. That's good shit. Um, I think we're at a good... Good point to stop for the night, too. Made it about two-thirds of the way through this place, and then we did the boss battle at the previous one as well. So for next time, then, we'll probably go one, two... Oh, man, it would be such a bad idea to go three here, but mmm, that equipment. So I guess we just took out a level 8 without too much problem. Then the level 9 is just like, ah. Uh. <laughs> I'd probably be pushing it a bit too much. Um, okay. Well, if we do one, two, oh wait. Actually, what would we need to do here? We'd probably need to go one, two, three. Uh, and that would be, that would be what we would need to do. So otherwise it doesn't work. And we've got that free heal there, so that's probably immediately before uh, the boss fight is so when we're going to pop that one. But alright, I think we're good to leave this for next time then. Alright, save progress. Good stuff! Like, we only had one person eat shit, and even then they got revived at the end of the mission anyway, so that was that was good. I was worried it was permadeath, and it turns out I was wrong, and I'm okay being wrong. Ah, but that'll do it for tonight. Next stream will be Wednesday night, 7 p.m. CDT, back here with Star Renegades. Probably finish up that area there, uh, move on to the final day's work, and then the 
big boss at the end, which is going to be interesting. And if we survive that, we'll be moving on to the final section, I think. Let's see how our skills uh, shape up to that. And Thursday, 7.30 p.m. CDT, it'll be Shmup Book Club. We'll have the new Shmup for month of uh, August, as well as the quarterlies for Universe and King of Force are still active. We got some of those as well. Friday, Saturday, we're off, and then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT, be long play. So more Talos Principle 2, more of the DLC puzzles to do. Should be fun. All right, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you on Wednesday. Bye-bye.